Mini Wargamer Dave here from MiniWarGaming.com. Welcome Wargamers to another work in progress update for this factory terrain gaming board. Now, I'm dying to show you the progress here. So take a look at this. John, chicka, John, chicka, John, John. Okay, I'll stop that now. Let's start over here. This is a little entrance, an underground entrance coming up, kind of like a subway, but not. It comes up to the inside of the factory here. The steps are made out of foam board. This is granny grating on top of foam board. Railings from the Pegasus chemical plant construction set. This railing right in the middle, that's the sprue that all of this stuff came on. So what you're looking at right here, I simply trimmed it up and cut it off and made a railing right in the middle. Now let's take a look at the extra platforms. This catwalk here, this T catwalk, I have joined from this building, which you may recognize from the tutorial on how to make these buildings. I've connected it here and to those two buildings. And it's all modular, so I can take it right off. And it doesn't have to be a catwalk if I don't want there to be. But since I do, let's place it right on there like that. It sits right on top very nicely. This building I've added to finish off the end of that catwalk. Put a little platform at the top there. I have finished off this building, this corner building, which was the very first building that this gaming board saw. I added the roof, I put this section on top of here, and I made another catwalk going down to the smokestack building. I've added another catwalk going from this building to the factory wall. Now for the outside, Sandra has created some hills here out of polystyrene, toilet paper, watered down PVA, a little bit of kitty litter and some gravel from outside, and dry brush three layers of paint, your reapers tan shadow, fair shadow, and polished bone. A three dry brush layer to get this effect. Now an, an idea came to mind just from creating these, and that is to add water effects all in between here, all in there, with some more of these, of course, different sizes of these. And so it's gonna look like it's murky and swampy and marshy. Still, I still need to work on the outside of the factory walls, create those buttresses. I still need to create this factory door. But I would say that this is pretty good progress for now. So that's the progress for now. I'll keep you posted. Happy Wargaming.